How many times in a day are the hands of a clock in straight line but in opposite direction? Let us see how. First, we will see the options. We have our options over here as A. 22 B. 21 C. 24 and D. 28 Let us see how to solve this. The hands of a clock will be in opposite direction 11 times in every 12 hours because between 5 and 7, they point in opposite directions only at 6 o'clock. So in a day, you have 24 hours, hence it is just the double, that is 11 into 2, 22. Hence option A, 22 is your answer. We have a clock over here which is accurate and it shows 8 in the morning. How many degrees will the hour hand rotate when the clock shows 2 in the afternoon? Well, this is not only an interesting question but also an important question as it has appeared in government, bank and HCL exams and TCS exams. We will see our options over here. Option A 144 degree Option B 150 degree Option C 168 degree Option D 180 degree Let us see how to solve this. The complete rotation of a hand here our ha hand will be 360 degree for 12 hours. So, if your ha hand rotates 360 degree for 12 hours, then how much degrees will it rotate for 6 hours? It is very easy. Total degree of rotation that is 360 divided by total hours for 360 degree rotation that is 12 multiplied by hours of difference to calculate that is 6. Telling out the values you get your answer as 180 degrees that is option D. Moving on to our next example over here. A clock is started at noon. That is, you are starting a clock at noon. And by 10 minutes past 5, the hour hand has turned through how much degrees? 10 minutes past 5 is nothing but 5.10. 5. 10. five hours and 10 minutes. Well, this is not only an interesting question but also very important as it has appeared in UPSC, SSC, RRB, Bank Exams, TCS, LNT and Higher Studies Exams. We have our options over here. Option A, 145 degrees. Option B, 150 degrees, option C 155 degrees and option D as 160 degrees. Let us see the logic. First, we have to find the angle for one minute. For one minute, how much angle does the hard hand make? Then, we have to calculate the total minutes for 5.10 that is till 5.10 how many minutes 
has the ha hand passed. It is obtained by multiplying your 5 with 60 plus 10 to convert your hours into minutes and add 10 to it. Then by multiplying the total minutes with the angle turned for 1 minute, you'll get your answer. Let us see how to apply this logic. The angle traced by a hour hand in 12 hours will be 360 degrees. So, in 12 hours, you have to calculate the number of minutes. Total number of minutes in 12 hours will be 12 into 60, that is 720 minutes. In 720 minutes, your hour hand rotates for about 360 degrees. So, in 1 minute, how much will be the angle? That is 360 divided by 720. It is nothing but half. The angle traced by a hour hand in 1 minute will be half. So, the angle traced by the hour hand in 5 minutes and 10. The angle traced by hour hand in 5 hours and 10 minutes should be calculated. So, for 5 hours and 10 minutes, we have to calculate the total number of minutes, which is nothing but 5 into 60 plus 10, that is 310 minutes. So, you have 310 minutes in 5 hours and 10 minutes. So, if your hand rotates half angle for 1 minute, then for 310 minutes, how much will it rotate? Simply multiply your half with 310. You get your answer as 155 degree. So, the angle traced in 5 hours and 10 minutes will be 155 degrees. That is, Option C.